Hey y'all, it's Brianna. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be going to clean and detail the inside of my Jeep Grand Cherokee. If you guys didn't see, I have a car tour down below. I also posted an updated video a couple months ago about how my Jeep has been driving, the experience, and how much my monthly car payments and insurance are. That will be linked down below. I'm about to get my stuff to go wash my car. So for Christmas of this past year my dad got me a bunch of um car cleaning items that are somewhere oh it's up here um a bunch of stuff oh gosh i cannot one hand this hold on oh, <laughs> a bunch of things to clean my car with um that i'm gonna take with me to the car wash so i have a bunch of microfiber towels to clean and dry my car with um, I have this tire wet, but I think I'm actually going to use something else. A bunch of these cleaning pads, and then there's a liquid wax, some leather seat cleaner, and just some general armor all. I also think I have a couple of other things too. Um, these ones have handles so that I can clean and scrub my car. And I think I also have a glass spray somewhere that I need to find. But I'm going to get all this together, go to the car wash. I just got back from a run, so I'm already kind of like dirty and sweaty and workout clothes. So might as well give my Jeep a nice good clean. I will see you guys at the car wash. Okay, I found the other stuff in this Ikea bag. So I have another tube of um, leather seat cleaner. These are glass wipes. And then this is basically just the spray version of those wipes. So I'm gonna throw everything that I'm taking in here with me. I'm gonna take these things, um, a scrubber, and then a couple of towels and head out to the car wash. Okay, just got to the car wash. I stopped by my parents' house and got this tire clean stuff from my dad. Um, this car wash does have the app that you can use your card with, but I want to challenge myself to only use these leftover quarters from the last time that I washed my car. I have eight quarters or two dollars worth of quarters, and I like this particular car wash because every minute is only 25 cents, not a dollar like most. So I'm challenging myself for the wash and the vacuum to only use eight quarters. Okay. So let me kind of just show you guys what it looks like right now. It's been a while since I've cleaned my car. It's actually not too bad because I haven't been eating fast food. So sometimes there will be like leftover bags and cups, which is gross, but it's actually not super dirty. There is some dirt in there and this sunroof, the top part of the glass also gets pretty dirty. Um, my inside of the car isn't too bad, but my mat down here, if you guys can see, gets pretty dirty let me show you guys let me turn the car off and show you guys what the outside looks like there's also some weird crust right here that I don't know what it is and my driver's seat is like very like greasy from sunblock and just everything that I sit down with after a run okay oh here's what the outside looks like it's pretty dirty some bird poop up there. My tires are kind of dirty too. Okay. Not sure what's going on right there. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start washing my car. It's actually not too bad, but I do want to clean it and detail it. And yeah, the leather definitely does need to be cleaned. this thing so that once I soap it up I can scrub it. Okay, first I'm going to do a low pressure pre-soak.
Okay, so the time ran out, so there's no more foam coming out, but I'm still gonna go around and scrub it, then take this and keep scrubbing. Long way. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing a little bit of both. <laughs> okay, I have three quarters left because I saved two in my car for the vacuum, so I'm just going to rinse it off and then I'll be ready to go in for the vacuum. So car is cleaned and rinsed. Next I'm going to take my tire stuff and put it on my tires. Then I'll go park over and clean out the inside. Okay, so I'm not really sure what this stuff is. I think my dad made it, but I'm just going to put a little bit on my tires and you guys will see how shiny it makes them. And then I have this little microfiber thing to rub it on. Also, I'm sweating and let me just say it's incredibly hard to film yourself while washing your car. Just so you guys can see the difference, this side does not have any on. You can see how it looks kind of dry, and this side does have it on. It's nice and shiny looking. Now I need to wipe my hands off because tire stuff. Okay, next I'm going to take this really big microfiber towel and go around and gently towel dry the outside of my car. And then after that, I will finally work on the inside. spots but it was kind of hard to film and actually clean my car at the same time um, but I am gonna take out all my mats so I have rubber mats I forgot to rinse them off so what I'm gonna do is just take all of them out kind of shake them put them in the trunk and then after I vacuum the inside I'm gonna come back to the water and just gently rinse these off Okay, it's very crusty there. I have two quarters left and I'm about to vacuum. I forgot that I need to rinse off my mats. Um, the floor underneath the mats is not super dirty, so I'm gonna use one quarter to vacuum and then my last quarter to go back and rinse off my rubber mats. Moving my seat all the way back. This is also where I throw away any trash, which honestly, I only have like a receipt here. Normally I have lots of trash like down there and in the cup holders, but it's actually not super dirty. Okay, so that vacuum was not enough, so I didn't really get a great job, but you guys kind of get the gist of what I usually do. Next, I'm gonna take this Armor All Protectant and a microfiber towel and wipe down all of the non-leather surfaces, and then take these leather wipes and wipe down all the leather surfaces. And I'm gonna rub it in because last time I only used these and didn't rub it in and it was very streaky. So I actually need to get a second microfiber towel for the seats this center console and my gear shifter oh and the steering wheel so all the leather parts i'm going to wipe down with this okay let me see if this weird white thing comes out i sprayed the cloth already don't know what this is yeah it's coming out i'm actually going to directly this one. Oop, that was messy. And then wipe it off. Yeah, it's coming out. 
then I also get the door panel, these parts, and then this bottom part are not leather. This right here is leather. So yeah, you see how dirty it is down here. This is also difficult to do in film. Let me spray this. And then this white dusty stuff will come off. Um, last step is to do all of my leather, so I'm going to take these wipes and then after I'm going to rub it in the microfiber towel so that it does not get streaky and smudgy. Okay, so see how it looks all nice and shiny? Last time I just left it like this and it got super streaky. So now I'm gonna take this and rub it in so that it does not get streaky. Also, why have I not been filming on wide camera mode this whole time? Definitely opportunity missed. Okay, so see how that looks good, and then just gonna wipe. And I'll wipe this too, and then you guys get the point. I'm gonna do all of my seats and my steering wheel. Okay, and then these parts of the doors are also leather, so I'm going to do these. Okay, so actually one more thing that I'm gonna do, and sometimes I clean my trunk if I feel like it. Today is not one of those days. I need to clean the top of my sunroof, and so I'm gonna take these glass wipes. I'm gonna pull my car up so that I can stand on this thing over there to use this to wipe off the top. Okay, actually, I don't think this is gonna work. There's a curb there, so I can't pull up anymore. I think I'm gonna go back over there where I was before to see if I can get on the ledge. And if you guys, it's hard to see on camera, but the top of this is just very streaky and I need to be able to get up there. So I'm gonna go back over there by the water parts and try to stand on one of those things by the other vacuums. Okay, so I'm gonna stand on this to get to the top of my car. Actually, am I stupid? Or why don't I just do this, open my door, then take my shoes off and stand down here? I think I am stupid and could have been doing this the whole time. Oof. Yeah. Okay, I'm taking the wipes and also going around just doing the outside mirrors because it is a little bit streaky in some spots. I am obviously not a professional car washer, but I try to do the best I can. Um, if you guys can't tell, I'm sweating. If you are not sweating while washing your car, did you even wash your car? Oh, and these ones too. Okay, last but not least, I'm gonna rinse off these mats. Actually, the ones that go in the back seat are not very dirty, so I'm gonna put these ones back in the car and only rinse out um the front mats because these ones are really not that dirty also if you guys are wondering why i have rubber mats i did have the cloth mats but they were just getting way too dirty with like mud and just too hard to vacuum out these are rubber you can just rinse them off they're super easy to clean so if you um like run or do lots of outdoor activities where you're bringing in lots of dirt grass mud all the time you might want to invest in some rubber mats they do have name brands or like custom ones these ones are just from target from michelin that you cut yourself and so these were i think 30 dollars, maybe 40 super affordable and very easy to clean Okay, my last quarter is in here, um, so I'm just going to do a light wash because last time it like blew the mats away. Um, is there a spot for your ones? Yeah, I might just do this light one and let me spread these out. Yeah, these ones are more dirty. Um, actually, I think I'm only going to do the driver's side one because obviously I use this one. This one is not even really dirty, so I'm going to put this back in the car.
Okay, I'm gonna shake this off and then use another towel to dry it and then I will be on my way. Okay, I'm just gonna dab it dry and then put it back in the car. People are watching me film, so I feel kind of weird. Okay, here's the after. It's all nice and clean. And the inside is kind of detailed, but this is what it looks like on the outside. Tires, super shiny. Okay, I drove to a parking lot because people at the car wash were staring at me, but that is basically how I clean my car. Normally, I get deeper in there, but trying to film and clean at a car wash is kind of difficult, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, subscribe, leave any comments down below, and I will catch you guys in the next video.